Learning tricks in slots 1, 2 and 2, 3 is not that easy, but it is achievable. But learning them in 3, 4 is impossible. You are supposed to move pinky and ring finger separately, but it seems that there is some bond which just doesn't allow them to move separately. Such a huge pain in the ass, right? Wrong if you watch this video and follow a few simple practical things to develop your pinky. Because this is where all the problems of this slot are. Ring finger is fine, pinky is the weakest link. Hello spinners, you're on Penstock, channel about pen spinning. And today I will show you how I developed pinky to be able to perform tricks nicely with it. Pinky is undeveloped because it is the last finger of your hand. Notice how often you use it in normal life. 9 times out of 10 you don't. You use your thumb, your index, your middle in most cases. Less frequently, ring finger. And the only cases when you use your pinky is when you grab something, when you need to hold your fist. It makes pinky the least developed finger of all. Throughout your whole its life, it gets used to move only when you need your fist. It you never move it separately from other fingers. So there is no big surprise why you have hard times trying to move it separately from other fingers and especially separately from ring finger. But in pen spinning you need all your fingers to be as independent as it is possible. More independent they are, better your style looks. Of course it is not going to be easy, don't think that you can win your pinky to be so needy in, within one weekend. It is going to take some time, but hey, we are not in a hurry. Pen spinning is more of a marathon rather than sprint. But first, a little announcement. We finally have our subreddit named Pen Spin for you guys to show your skills. Don't forget to join it to keep in touch with other pen spinners. So, first of all, you need to understand that your pinky is not weak as muscles which control fingers are here in the arm, not in fingers. The whole matter is more about dexterity and flexibility. So, don't you try to train your pinky or other fingers you applying strength. First of all, I recommend you to do warming and stretching several times a day. You can find a small program on my channel, there is a special separate video regarding this thing. Link in the description or in the card. Woman and stretching before pen spinning session is very powerful and underestimated practice, which really helps a lot. Any activity requires you to warm up, right? You don't just jump in a sport gym and begin to pump iron just right out of the gate. You make your muscles prepared for exercises. The same goes for pen spinning as well, so don't neglect them. Pick a few exercises from this video and do them at least once per day. It wouldn't take you long. 3-5 minutes and you already feel the difference. Second, as we need to win pinky to move together with other fingers, you need to show it how to move independently. Hold your fingers and move pinky alone. When you feel confident and comfortable with it, release index finger and move pinky trying to keep index still. After that you can release middle and move pinky trying to keep both of these fingers still. After that, yes, you can release ring finger and try to move pinky independently. Just don't get upset if it doesn't work from the start. As every element, especially in pen spinning, it will come with practice. Another exercise looks like this. You need to make your fingers move separately. In particular pinky, as this video is dedicated to this finger. Hold your fingers and move pinky aside. After some time, begin to try to move it aside without holding other fingers. It would be better to be able to move each finger separately of others. First you develop your index, then, when you can do it somehow, you begin to move index and middle aside of ring and pinky. And finally we move pinky aside from other fingers alone. The best way to develop your pinky is actually using it. Learn tricks in 3-4. Pay more attention on them than on other slots as they need more attention. The first good trick for developing pinky is finger pass. Yes, the first fundamental. Easy and hard at the same time. Doing it in slots 3, 4 and 2, 3 continuously makes your pinky move keeping rings still. But 
the best beginner trick for developing Pinky, to my mind, is double charge 3-4-2-3 and or double charge reverse 3-4-2-3. If you don't know how to do it, learn. It is not just a good looking trick which you can do continuously. In fact, just knowing this trick only will make you a god of pen spinning in front of your friends. Not charge continuous, which is pretty useless at its own. No. Double charge is the king. I'm going to make a video tutorial for this trick real soon, so you could know the best way to master it. Why I like it so much when it comes to Pinky's development? It makes this finger move actively while you have to keep ring still and straight. So it contains pretty much everything you need to develop Pinky. At the same time you learn to move your pen mode in circles. And the best thing it is simple. Double charge is much easier to learn than ring around or reverse, for example. Which is my second favorite trick for training Pinky. It develops a bit another movement. Double charge is good to teach your Pinky bend. A round teaches it to move up and down. To be able to do ring around, you have to move Pinky fast while other fingers stay still. Keeping on doing these two tricks will dramatically increase your pinky's dexterity, but I'd recommend you not to stop on them. Make this finger work. Make it feel useful. And after some time you will find yourself doing tricks with a great style. Notice that jabbers are famous for their style. And a big part of it is formed by their ability to move fingers independently. You know how to shadow in 1, 2 and 2, 3? Great, but why not mastering it in 3-4 to make it with even more confidence in this slot? I think you've got the point. If so, if you like this video and found it helpful, let me know about that in the comment section below this video, or just leave a like. My name is Alex Suhov, may the style be with you. Bye.